days. I want to give you some new information here on the Gilmer County tornadoes. Remember, this was a couple weeks ago on May 8th and 9th, and the National Weather Service confirmed one tornado in the Ellington Road area. But you know, they do these surveys and look at the damage to, to really confirm, number one, how many tornadoes and how strong they were. The terrain there was so rough, so it took a while for them to get us the rest of the surveys here. But today they're confirming three additional tornadoes on that event on May 8th and 9th, that late night there. Uh, the additional one was at Tails Creek Road. It was an EF1 at 90 miles an hour. The Weeks Road area, an EF0 at 85 mile an hour winds. And Owltown Road, an EF0 at 85 mile an hour winds. So that's a total of four tornadoes from that night in Gilmer County. And then four additional tornadoes were down mainly in the parts of central Georgia. But now we're just talking about a lot of heat. 84 right now in Atlanta and Duluth and in Athens. How about Peachtree City at 86 degrees right now? Rome also checking in at 86. Here's what we're going to be watching during the evening hours tonight. I've been talking about just those few isolated showers in North Georgia. Again, that east wind hitting the mountains. That's why they may see just a couple of showers there. I really think they're going to be falling apart. Chances for any of those popping up here are very low and then overnight in the morning still watching that east wind might kick up a couple of showers to the north and east of us but mainly during the day tomorrow it is going to be dry just talking about a lot of warm air with temperatures in the mid 80s here once again and then into Wednesday another dry day but those temperatures warming up even more as we go through the rest of the week we're going to be talking about some of the warmest air so far of the season so far our hottest day has been 87 degrees we think we'll get above that on Thursday with a high of 89 maybe even some areas getting up to 90 degrees with that dry weather over the next few days here. Then temperatures hold in the upper 80s to near 90 for Friday, Saturday, Sunday and Monday. But the other thing we have to watch the potential for rain on Friday, 30% chance for showers, 40% chance Saturday, Sunday and Monday. We'll keep tweaking those percentages and help you time out which areas and when we might see some of those showers for the long holiday weekend.